Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. In today's video you will find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, EMA and RSI are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the IOTA hourly time frame, the price moved quickly to the upside with around 4.4% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 45.3 cents. However, the volume wasn't especially high, so this move wasn't very strong. Moving to the hourly simple moving averages, the price crossed the 20 SMA upwards it's a strong signal that there has been a higher than average volume. For this time interval, the current price is above all of the simple moving averages, which looks bullish and you should watch if the closest SMA, the 20 SMA could remain stable or the price will dip below it with the current price of around 44.3 cents. For longer price development, the daily time frames should also be considered as the shorter time frames are not as accurate. Moving to the hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is above the hourly ribbon, which is generally bullish and the ribbon could play as a support, so it is to watch if the price could bounce off it. The current price to watch is around 43.3 cents. The ribbon is spread out so the support should be strong. Looking at the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 64, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Moving to the three hourly simple moving averages, the current price is above all simple moving averages for this time interval, which looks bullish and it is to watch if the closest SMA, the 100 SMA could hold support or the price will break it to the downside below the current price of around 42.8 cents. Looking at the three hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the three hourly ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 42.5 cents. Nevertheless, a trend change can be expected owing to the ribbon being compressed, which means that the trend is currently not very strong. Usually, when the price moves to the side, the ribbon is less reliable. Jumping to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI of 67 is located in the upper region, meaning that the price is being overbought and we can expect a comeback or for the price to remain on track for some time. Jumping to the daily simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is above all of the simple moving averages, which looks bullish and you should watch if the closest SMA, the 20 SMA could remain stable or the price will dip below it with the current price of around 43.3 cents. Moving to the daily exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the daily ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 38.3 cents. The ribbon is spread out so the support should be strong. Jumping to the daily relative strength index, the current daily RSI is at 59, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.